Video stores across the country are going out of business, and a once popular Springfield video store is now just a pile of rubble. Another reminder of the end of this moviegoer era. KEZI 9 News reporter Tim Benson is live in the studio to explain why the old kings of video are on their way out. Tim? Jessica, the only ones coming to this video store anymore are bulldozer operators. The Hollywood video at Gateway Mall was recently demolished, a reminder of the end of an entertainment era. Stores like Hollywood Video at the Gateway Mall used to generate lots of revenue. In Hollywood Video's prime, the company was worth close to a billion dollars. But when was the last time anyone used these traditional stores? That was uh, quite a while ago, about years two or three years ago. Uh, it's been a couple of years at least. I mean, like Blockbuster, they're not in the town no more. Even Blockbusters had to close up shop lately, a real sign of the times. But for movie fans, it's not worth the time. There's simply too many easier options. Redbox and Netflix, it's a lot easier. I don't have to leave the house as much. Netflix, on the other hand, is doing better than ever. The company booked close to a billion dollars last quarter alone. It offers fans easy access that suits a technology crazed audience. As the internet is like rising and all the technology, you can just go like on your phone and get Netflix right off your phone or laptop or anything. And the introduction of these new forms of video rentals has put stores all over the country out of business. And now Gateway Mall will finally replace a longtime tenant. Now, the Gateway Mall was unavailable to comment on what will replace the Hollywood Video Building. Rumors are that a Buffalo Wild Wings restaurant could be coming to town to take its spot. In the studio, Tim Benson, KEZI 9 News.